opponent 3-1 and then came through in the semi-final with a 3-0. So we have Steven Da Costa for France in red, 22 years old. Dida Amarilli for Kazakhstan in blue. Referee for the bout, Yasuhisa Abe from Japan. Just a, a slight adjustment. Yes. De Costa picks up a warning for holding on. Category two. Oh, wow, that was close, wasn't it? Um, miss. He, he, he missed, yeah, he yes. did miss, but it was very... <laughs> wow. De Costa With just the back moved leg his head back also, out eh? of the way. With a back leg. Yes. brilliant combination yes. of attacks yes. with a punch moved back out again took the leg with the yashi barai followed up with a fabulous this is, suki for it this is karate classic say, that really, was a classic really karate right. technique clean fast it's the type that you'll see featured on youtube and the like in yes. years to come so steven da costa in red, leading Dida Amarelli from Kazakhstan. He has the three points and he has the central advantage. Should have a watch the attempt there from Amirali. to one minute 23 seconds and again a fantastic technique but this time <laughs> it's from Amirali yes and then it on video review challenge but uh, video review is not a uh, relevant not because he's given the point yes So if he receives the points, then the video... Wow. The coach is... No problem. The coach is compressed a button, but uh, yes. he doesn't lose a card or anything like that. It's uh, just back into the action. It's just three points each, and it is still Steven Da Costa in red, leading by the Sensu advantage. Tried to take that front leg of Da Costa, just losing his balance in the process. Into the last 30 seconds now, three each, and there's still Stephen Da Costa with the central advantage. That's the only difference between these two. Da Costa now receives a Kekoku category two. Into the last 15 seconds, Atoshi Baraku called Amarali, tries Suzuki, the cost of trying to keep him away, both down to the tatami. And it's Amarali who's going to be penalized, Hans Sokachui in the last eight seconds, the cost of trying to Yoko go to keep him off, 
Under punch, he cannot afford to hold on. He doesn't want to lose that. Senju falls down to the tatami as the clock goes to zero, yes. zero. And the win goes to Steven De Costa. Another gold medal for another young winner.